After a PCM replacement, we have to reset the security system. Right now we're getting access. In progress, it says that this operation has been successful. We press OK. Security access granted. Press OK. Now we're going to uh, ignition key code erase and program. It's going to require two keys and we have both keys in hand. And we press OK. We have a warning. You will need two keys to start the vehicle. Do you wish to continue? Press OK. Operation in progress. OK. This operation has been successful. All known keys have been erased. You must now program a minimum of two keys. We press OK. Turn the ignition off. Disconnect the, the scan tool from the vehicle. Wait 10 seconds. Cycle number one, key into ignition from off to run for at least three seconds. We do the second key, the same thing, and then the original first key, and the two keys will not be programmed. Let's go ahead and do that. I'm gonna go ahead and press OK. Okay, first ignition key from off to run, three seconds. Take it off. Second key. Three seconds. We remove it. First key. Three seconds. There we go. Vehicle is running. Okay, the reason we replaced the powertrain control module on this one is because the TR transmission range 4 was shorted to ground internally in the powertrain control module now we're gonna go through the shift quadrant and see what uh, what it reads so we're gonna look at the TRC digital transmission range calculation from TR1 through 4 and it's gonna show us uh, what gear it is so we're in park reverse before it was showing uh, in between park and reverse neutral in overdrive uh, range, it was going all the way to manual low. On manual second, it would go to manual low and manual low, manual low. So now we have confirmed uh, that we have fixed this uh, problem on this vehicle. The problem was not the transmission. Transmission was not shifting. Uh, uh, transmission range sensor was replaced with a new one. It was not the transmission range sensor. It was the powertrain control module. And this concludes our uh, diagnostics and repair for this 2004 Taurus with an AX4 and transmission. This is Dr. Trent signing off. If you have any comments or questions, please leave.